Good afternoon. Welcome to the Midday Mall for Friday the 16th of September. In my case, it's a morning mall. I was privileged to come out here to the beauty of the Waterberg um, to do a communion service with some boys who are on a wilderness school experience. And you may hear the weavers in the background and the orioles calling. Um, and a little glimpse in my uh, artistic introduction of just a glimpse of the, the beauty of the Waterberg. And Murray McShane has us reading Psalm 65, where David reflects on God's glory. He describes him, um, if I can just quickly turn it up, he describes God as God our Savior, the hope of all the ends of the earth and of the farthest seas. And then he looks at the world and he sees God's imprint on it everywhere. He says, the whole earth is filled with awe at your wonders. Where morning dawns, where evening fades, you call forth songs of joy. And certainly this morning, as I watched the sky turning red and the, uh, the details of the world emerging as the morning dawned, songs of joy were what were called for. Uh, he continues and says, you drench its furrows and levels its ridges. You provide, God provides so much for us. You crown the year with your bounty and your carts overflow with abundance. The grasslands of the wilderness overflow and just driving out here into this wilderness area um, the grasslands were abundant with life you don't notice it until you stop and look but the grasslands of the wilderness overflow and the hills are clothed with gladness and certainly sort of as I looked around my heart <laughs> resonated with what David was saying um, we have a God who is our saviour the hope of the ends of the earth and of the father's seas. And as we look around our world, sometimes the beauty is obvious. Sometimes we have to look a little more closely. Sometimes the world would have us mask the beauty and just have us see the, the ugliness of the world. And certainly there are plenty of ugly things normally caused by sin. But we have to look beyond them and see undergirding it, behind it all, is this world of beauty, that wonder and glory that God has created and so we join David in <laughs> lifting our voice in in praise and songs of joy for God our Savior the hope of the ends of the earth and of the farthest sea I pray that you'd see him wherever you are and you'd be blessed <laughs>